she really does have him wrapped around her finger no like he does everything and anything she says uh, right this is where we left off i already forgot honestly like <gasps> who's going he gonna ugh, why am i surprised it's minji it's minji it's minji uh, there's nobody else Cho Minji. I guess he must have moved on from Hesong. Eh? Alright, alright, they've gone. Let's move on to the next couple, please. Hesong started it when she picked Wanik for Paradise. So I decided to pay her back for that so she understands how I felt. This isn't just about me and Minji, it's also about me and Hesong. This guy is a total asshole! So he's just paying her back. <laughs> But they agreed on it. Why would he phrase it like that? I mean, Q is taking Guri. The person I'd like to go to paradise with is... Probably it's Guri. There's nobody else he should be taking, right? Or will he take someone else? No. It's Guri. Miss Kim Kyuri. He said it already. It's Guri till the end. Well, that was pretty obvious. There was a part of me that wanted to talk with Mino. That part of me wanted to stay behind, so I was a little disappointed as well. If you've moved on from the guy, let exactly. him know, though. Mr. Sun for third place. Who is one Eek gonna pick? That is my question. Mr. That Sun is Wan my Eek. question. Coffee's You'd kicking like in, people. <laughs> I don't think he will pick Sheon because she already told him, right? Oh, she'll be so disappointed if he does. Miss Yu Shun. One ink! Right. I know. <sighs> I had no other choice. Mm -hmm. God, their timing One is ink! So she off. said no! She said no! The person Mr. Uh, has selected is Miss Yu Shun. But I'm actually happy because Minu does not deserve to be with Shun. No. He should go with Giri. Ah, oh, but he said, she said no. Damn. No surprise there. None at Damn. All. Oh, I was hoping either Cutie or Shion would stay. Can you imagine? He doesn't even have designs on anyone. I swear, it's like Minu's the male version of Cho Minu. Yes. I mean, come on, Nuna. This isn't a show where you place all your bets on one person. He's not doing anything yes. against the rules. Right, come right. on. God, I'm so you sorry I got worked up like people. that. I think it will be in her best interest to see if she can. Wanik, it would be in her best interest to go for Wanik because I don't trust Minu. I don't trust Minu at all. Good for him. Good for him. I'm actually low key happy about that. That the fact that both girls are not there. Oh, 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 Min Young and Jin Suk. Alright, let's see. After treating me like that? Like what? What's he looking for? <laughs> Oh, how does that look? <laughs> what is he looking for? <laughs> he still likes her, though. The way he's flirting, he still likes her. You tell me to express my feelings, and when I do, ask me why I'm doing it. You're so annoying. Wait, I... Jeez. God, be for fucking real. Did I say that? Yes. I'm not interested in anyone else. Oh, oh, you're oh. not? You're not? <laughs> you're all they talk about, you know? Me? Well, turns out the girls are all huge Jinsuk fans. Oh. They really straightened me out. You didn't need straightening mm. out. Why? I want to take a trip with you. Yeah. To where? Me too. I could have if I went today. I know, right? Yeah. I might not have oh, taken you. paradise. I don't know why I reacted <laughs> like that. <laughs> okay, okay. Oh, he's still very much into this girl. Did you see the way he was looking at her just now? Very much. Okay, this... A lot of you think that I hate Guan He. I don't. I hate Guan He conversations because he recycles his conversations between all the girls. And I'm tired of hearing it. And in the spirit of not liking Guan He conversations, guys, you know I had to come and do a voiceover because these people talk for six minutes without actually saying anything. By the end of their whole date, I was even more confused than when we started first. 
episode because Guan He, I don't know if Guan He knows what he wants. Guan He talks a good game with whoever is in front of him, but he still doesn't specify. These women are busy validating him every single fucking time, and he does nothing in return. So I still don't understand why. Why all of them are so attracted to him. It just pisses me off. It riles me up. It gets me agitated. And I just can't do it anymore. So it occurs to me that Guan He acts differently depending on the people he's he with. He does treat he Hezun does. differently. He does. And he treats yeah. Hajong differently. My thing with Guan He. Let's talk about Guan He and Minji. Minji is a bombshell. This girl should be on uh, Love Island because I think she will kill it. I don't know if there's a Love Island Korea, but they should probably think about doing it because I think it's going to be hella interesting. I don't think when he's into Minji, I, I feel like I didn't even think that he was into anybody but Ha Jung. But after what he said about, you know, picking um, Hae Song and the way he acts around Hae Song, I think that, yes, Hae Song is his number one. She is the one that he's going to probably end up with at the end. Now, I'm just calling shots here. I don't know what will happen, but if I had to place a bet, I would bet that it will be Guan Yi and Hae Song walking away into the sunset together. Okay, let's see if Wanik can turn things around with Sheehan. I doubt it, but let's see. But I wanted to come in ahead of one person in particular. Which one? Minu. Mm. Is he gonna say? Minu. Yes, uh. of course. Yeah, I don't know if that was a good idea to bring up Minu. Considering we don't really see them on a date after this scene, you definitely are sure that this is a dead end. Obviously, she likes Minu, so we know that they're not coming back from this. So let's just keep, move on, people. I wanted to come here with you. No. I. Because he likes her. That's how Wanik feels right now. Yeah. True. She don't like him. And then I'm really kind of thankful that the time he was off between you guys. She won't want to hear that though, dude, like, cause she likes him. So, I kind of hope the timing stays off until the end. Oh, she doesn't oh, want to hear that. His honest feelings. Oh, it's romantic, like to us watching, but to her, she's like, damn you, motherfucker. <laughs> you know, <laughs> not that dramatic, but you know, see, she hasn't even said anything. She even talks, but she hasn't said anything throughout this whole encounter. Let's see how Guri is going to act on this date. Do you like it? Did you know I was going to pick you? Well, I thought so, but I wasn't sure. Yeah, he didn't... He didn't go with anyone else, right? He didn't pick anyone else. Who are you cheering uh, for, Grace? Oh, Cheering for? Yes. I don't know. You know, that's a lie. Yeah. That's a lie. She knows who she was cheering for. He could have said it. Just say it. Okay. So this is where I lost all respect for Giri. And I'm not, I'm just being over dramatic people. Like, obviously, I don't hate them or anything. But here's the thing. It's Singles Inferno. You're allowed to date. You are encouraged to date multiple people. And if you lose interest in the person who is currently interested in you, be honest. That is the least that we can ask of anybody on this show. Just be honest and say, just to be frank... I feel like my feelings are swaying towards another person. What everybody seems to be doing on this show is having plan B, which is what Guan He has been doing from the first episode. It is what Min Wu was doing. It is what Yuri is currently doing. Min Q does not deserve that. Min Q chose her from the beginning. Now, is that his fault for choosing only one girl? You could say yes. However, he stated the facts that this is who he wants till the end. Again, considering we don't see them after this scene, kind of tells you where this is headed. Into what's the ratio? Well, we'd like the answer to Hajan's question too, actually. Totally. His feelings for Shion and Kyuri. Kyuri. How are they distributed? Don't you think Kyuri might have a higher score right uh -huh. now? She does. It's Kyuri. But I feel like he should go to paradise with uh, Shion at least once for him to fully decide he's all caught up in the oh the popular girl likes me right now and that's what's driving him gaga and it's like oh i'm the big man on campus you know <laughs> one here minji 
This is Guan He's room. They always bring him to this particular room. Want to go look around? Every time I've been here, this was my spot. Uh, yeah, that's what spot. I said. Um, every time? Yes, I'll. Uh... I want this spot. Have these. Watch them, please. Oh my God, she's very bossy. Hey, he's just doing it he's too. He's doing oh it. God. Without a word of protest. <laughs> He's That's what I to said. Do what he's pushing yeah, back. Right? right? Imagine if Ha Zhang had told him that. He would have said you oh, lost. He would know. Interesting. I swear I can't figure this guy out. Which makes for great content. He is great content. I'm not gonna lie. What'd you eat? Some cherries. Cherries? Give me the pit. No, no, Here, it's spit fine. it out. Okay. Wow, he's very attentive though. I can't figure this man out. Nice I cannot. Him. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I didn't know he could be so considerate. Actually, no, he's always usually considered like this because with Hyesung, he kept giving her stuff, putting stuff on her plate. The only person that he doesn't really take care of as much is Ha Jung. Because you know I like to skip the Guan He conversations. The first half of this conversation was three minutes. And the most important thing to me that they said in this was that she asked Guan He what his type was. And he said he likes girls with big eyes that can be that can act cute. And I'm pretty sure he told Hyesung that he likes bubbly girls so again just solidifies the fact that when he caters to whoever is sitting in front of him he's the classic type who says insert name here that is my type so whoever is in front of Guan He is who is his type in that moment. So honestly, I felt like a pinball on a in a pinball machine. Guan He kept hitting me left, right, and center because at some point I'll be like, oh, I don't think he likes her. And then he will say something or do something that just confused me even more. And then I'll be like, no, he's he seems to be swaying towards Hei Song or keeping with Hei Song. And then he does something with Minji that just throws me off. I don't think the man knows what he wants. I'll say it now and I'll say it at the end when he does his final choosing. He don't know what he wants. If he says all this, <laughs> then goes after his son again. That's exactly what I I'm know. Talking. Don't cut Hajung out yet right. either. <laughs> Maybe I've just been doing this all wrong. Not at all. guan has been going back and forth too constantly. This is what I think. Some people leave a good impression on you because they're just nice people. He told me that the two of us just felt different. Uh-huh, yeah. Because I thought my relationship with Guan He had a sturdier foundation, considering all that we had built up over time. Hmm. And I thought I was really more his type. Honestly, girl, I don't know either. I don't know. Oh, I forgot to also say that the only reason why he is off Ha Zhang was because she told him the truth and she yelled at him and she pointed out everything that he was doing wrong. That was truly the only reason why he he, he clicked off Ha Zhang. He doesn't like to be talked to like that. No, seriously though. I know they're here. Tell me though, what happens if they're not here? Are they here or not? Huh? Are they here or not? I don't know. Oh! Oh, oh, it's physical touch, people. That's a different ball game. That's a different ball game. No, that's a different ball game. Fair or not? I don't know. Ah! Okay, I'm sorry. No, you're just naturally seductive. Not just seductive. You live and breathe seduction. Yeah, you're the only one who doesn't <laughs> yeah. realize. You know how you looked at me when we first met? <laughs> Welcome. <laughs> Come to think of it, at the time I couldn't tell if it was seduction or just fear I was sensing. <laughs> but that's your look. Isn't He's so funny. Or back to these people. Is he gonna give her the aromatherapy thing? He is. He is. Oh my god. Okay, you know what? He's just sharing a good product. I'm not gonna hold it against him. Change in the bathroom. And give me your pants. Done changing? Uh huh. What is this? Oh, I guess I got some on myself just now. The chair, too. That look actually suits you, though. How's he gonna get it off, though? She really does have him wrapped around her finger, no? Like, he does everything and anything she says. I'm just flabbergasted because yeah. we've never seen Absolutely. these aspects of Guan He before, and they just yeah, keep so coming. Really? But does anybody think that he's maybe treating her like a sister? I can't think of anything to say. I will say it sure looks like Guan He's gonna go with Minji though. Yeah. It's over. We need to see him talk to Hei Song first. We need to see him talk to. Hey, Dick Furno. 
Someone else said that and it's stuck in my head, people. Uh, she was equal parts fun and cuteness, I guess. I see. Us? We talked for a bit last night and then we all just went to bed. What was Hesan up to? Haha! <laughs> I, I don't have much Why is with he Hesan. bringing her up? I kind of avoided her. Was she like talking to someone? Why is he so all about Hesa? Man doesn't know what he wants. It was really relaxing for me, and I had a lot of fun, which is great. And he told me about his job. I didn't think Minji and Guan He would have much chemistry. So she just like. So at first I didn't care how their paradise trip went, but then it sounded like Minji was really into him. So I guess I'm a little less confident now. I'll have to wait and see. Aww. He even said he wants someone who makes it very clear she's into him. I feel like he wants someone who goes, I like you, right up front. But that's what Hajjung did. did though. Yeah. But you did it a little late. No. Really? In the beginning? Um, Hajjung. Minyoung is not the person to be taking relationship advice from. I'm sorry. You have to win this, please. Oh, God. And if you don't come in first, go to whoever finished in front of you and ask them not to take Minu. Seriously, no, I'm being serious. Right? That sounds ridiculous. No, Why? it doesn't. Let's go, Shiyun. It doesn't, it's single really inferno. This time. I already saw clips, so Shiyun is not winning anything. It's gonna be a three way fight between Hajong, Minji, and Hayson. So it was time for the girls to play a game, and it was chicken? Chickens? Chicken fit? I don't know, the game had chicken in it. Anywho, first to go were Guri and Hayson. And Hayson honestly came with the game face. She we say decked in Nigeria, she decked Giri. It was also payback for the last game where Giri got the tail and the cap off like within a second. Second to go was Shiyun and Hajong. Um, Shiyun kind of forgot the rules and started using her hand and Hajong ultimately won. Honestly, Hajong was way better at the game anyways. Third was Min Young versus Minji and we all know that Min Young sucks at games. <laughs> She's absolutely terrible. She lost the quickest. It was an easy defeat. Minji took her down pretty easily. And then that left a three-way battle between Haesong, Hajong, and Minji. Oh. Looks fiery. Wait, Che Haesong, Yoon Hajong, and Cho Minji? This That's Guan He's three. Right. It's a battle for Guan He. It crazy. is a battle for Guan He. I knew it right away. So I made this they should just name this event after me. Ugh. Call it the Iguani Derby. Uh. 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 Man, has made me roll my eyes so many times. Look how happy Kwani is. He's so freaking well, of happy. Course. Look, there are three beautiful women here, all fighting over right. him right now. So of course, yeah, over it's the an moon, ego right? boost. I can't even imagine how thrilled I'm he must sure be. Ego boost ego. for him. Huge. Oh, was oh, that a code for them to oh. go out there? Wow. Oh! Whoa, uh, her eyes are. She just like she signaled Minji someone? to take out Hajo. Oh boy. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh. Hayson does this thing where she waits it out and sees who is going. I'm tired of standing there. And then oh. she'll go. Oh! 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 Oh, see? See what I mean? See what I mean? Now she's she coming comes. in. Here comes Hayson. Oh, she the does that. Oh, 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 Who's she going after, oh, though? Who's she going after? Oh, no! <laughs> Useless people! And that's where the episode ended. There's a lot to unpack, but I will be doing that after episode 9, which will come out either tomorrow or the day after, people. But yeah, I was absolutely excited. I knew that Song, this was a game for Song to win because she waits. She watches, she strategizes, and she waits. And we'll see what happens in episode 9. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!